Not all of my spring break rail fanning was spent at Rochelle. I did have time to go to other places on other days. Many of my catches are grab and go when I've only got an hour or two to film trains. A good example of this would be this catch right here. I was waiting for 8701 to pass by on a westbound stack train, one of the last two Chicago or Northwestern Dash 9s. However, 8701 was delayed for an unknown reason, and after an hour of waiting at the tracks at Meredith, Illinois, the only train I caught was this westbound sand train led by an AC4400 CW and a pair of SD70Ms. A few days later, I'm over at Spalding Junction near Elgin, Illinois. We're waiting on CP train 472 with the daily eastbound manifest from Nahant Yard in the Quad Cities to Chicago. Today, the train is led by a former Milwaukee Road SD40-2. all the action I would get this week. However, the next weekend, I was out yet again. After being informed that two very unique locomotives will be running on the BNSF's Mendota sub this Sunday afternoon, I decided to make the 30-mile drive from my house to Bristol, Illinois. Most trains I film are within 20 miles of my house, however, if I've got the time and enough fuel to get there and back, I will drive further distances if necessary to catch good trains. Before the first train I was intending to catch came through, the eastbound Southwest Chief appeared in the distance and came through Bristol a couple minutes later. A little while later, the eastbound California Zephyr comes through. This train had several interesting things about it, including Amtrak number 42, the veterans unit trailing second, an extra baggage car and observation car on the end of a train, and the large blue numbers on the 163.
About five minutes later, the westbound California Zephyr comes through. Coming up right behind Amtrak number 5 on the other track is a westbound crude oil train led by a pair of BNSF Dash 9s. Five minutes later and here comes Amtrak train number three, the westbound Southwest Chief. Another half hour later, and finally, here comes a train I have been waiting for. An eastbound oil train led by NS-1074, the Lackawanna Heritage Unit. This train was originally supposed to go to the Norfolk Southern at Streeter, Illinois. However, at the last minute, the routing was changed, and now it was heading for Chicago. long drive ahead of me, it's time for me to head back north. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more train videos coming away soon from CNW 6871 Productions.